All right, good morning, YouTube. So, as you can see, it's raining again. And this is probably the only view we might get for the day <clears throat> because the weather is stocking itself in. But uh, this is called the pulpit. And we're probably a couple miles in from, I think it's Reliable Springs Road is where we started today. So, I'll have to put on some rain gear. All right, so a little bit off the trail coming to find somebody's got this is actually a little private property was it uh, property of Lehigh Amateur Astronomical Society from Allentown they got a privy right there they got uh, some observatories I'm guessing that might be a camera or something and I guess they lock up their gear or something there but it's pretty cool well kept too the lawn is maintained somebody's taking care of this area but somebody ain't taking the rocks out of that trail, I'll tell you that right now. So the snakes are molting. Not sure what kind that used to be, but uh, let's see, he's got some new skin now. It's not a rattle on the end, so it could be something else. All right, coming up on a beautiful waterfall here. Those are actually coming out of those rocks. So I guarantee you that water's cold. But about halfway done with the day, there uh, really hasn't been much for views, other than uh, the little bit that we had earlier. Uh, that's the other side of it. Going down. But I uh, thought it was going to rain today. Well, it did rain a little bit, but thought it was going to be a downpour all day, and it has held off at least for the last two or three hours. Uh, so, kind of excited about that, not having to plug through the rain yet maybe it's coming later I don't know we'll see but uh, just chilling along walking north and I will do more video later all right so I had to kind of step down into these to get this picture but that's uh, that's postcard stuff right there pretty cool nice campsite over there too we are headed today or I'm headed to uh, right now, this uh, Eagle's Nest Shelter, I think is what it's called. And it's another one of the uh, shelters with, uh, it's enclosed. And uh, I think Fresh Ground is gonna be there cooking lunch. So, pretty excited about that because the pancakes that we had this morning, I'm, uh, they've run out, I'm hungry. Uh, less than two miles to get there. And that'll be 10 for the morning. And then I think we're going to do another 9 this afternoon. So as long as the weather holds out. All right. Things turned uh, nice and pretty here. Everything's green. And this is actually a really nice section of trail. Amazingly enough, there's some rocks in it. But it's not, uh, not bad at all. So enjoying this so far. I know it's going to get rockier as the day goes on. All right. PT out for now. All right, everybody, I think I said Eagle's Nest Shelter earlier in the video. Actually, I'm headed to Eckville Shelter. <clears throat> Starts with an E, close enough. But uh, Adasa just texted me and said that she, sorry about that, in fresh ground, just saw a big black bear. So maybe there'll be a bear out here on the trail. I don't know, but... She's excited she got to see a bear out here, but that's cool. All right, got a little uphill here, and then gonna be at the shelter for lunch. PT out. All right, another look out here. All right, so I walked right past that guy, and he didn't even rattle at me. Holy moly. Gotta keep my eyes out. He's just sunning. Okay, so I haven't moved an inch from the last snake I just showed you. And there's another one. Right there. Holy moly. Crazy. Alright, there's number three. All within a 
10 foot space of each other. This one's sleeping too. I'm going to have to go around him. I don't want to startle him, that's for sure. Holy moly, this is Snake City. Alright everybody, haven't taken much video today because I've had to keep my eye on every step because second half of my day has been this all day long. So the rocks are here and I can't uh, can't film and walk them at the same time because that is uh, way too much. So rock hopping, got about two, a little over two miles to go for the day and that'll give us uh, I think 19. And uh, so far making it through, feet are hurting but they usually hurt at the end of the day. All right, more later.